So, Darkest Dungeon. New update. This thing just came out today. Actually, that's the truth. Darkest Dungeon just came out today. Today was the release date. So, it is in its final form. And, um, well, not really final form, but it is in its release form. Ruin and there's a ton of new things, ton of changes. Way. And this you is the first time I'm playing Darkest Dungeon. Opulent and imperial, while it's not fully in beta. Proudly from its stoic perch above the moor. So here we go. Um, I'm ready to lose another Willoughby or another Ponka. Vine sauce, in quote, in parentheses, many attempts have been made to bring up this topic. So, Derwin, I was just playing a game where it was nearly impossible to look away from the screen. So, uh, I did see your message about 30 times, and the answer is I have not seen Making a Murder documentary. No, Making a Murderer, sorry. I plan on watching it maybe if I have nothing else to watch, but it's it's right now not something on, on the list. Okay. So here we go. Um is everyone full? Yeah, I have a full roster. Okay, so the roster is full. Um, two of my characters are recovering. It's okay, Derwin, I don't mind. It's, it wasn't spam. I'm just saying, there's probably gonna be a lot of times where it's difficult to reach me when I play certain games, especially more action-oriented games. This one, I can read the chat a bit. Uh, I also appreciate not, um, being spammed with questions. You didn't spam. Maybe 30 was an exaggeration, but... I do appreciate the chat and the participation. Um, okay, so I guess right now I'm just gonna go on a mission because because um, I want to get to it. Oh God, here it is, the darkest dungeon. That's how you beat the game, everyone. This is finally available and there is no chance in hell I'm gonna be able to do that tonight. Shit. Here's some spam I asked about already. Is Red Vox on Spotify? When the album is out, you bet. Definitely. I'm gonna well, to the best of my ability. Alright, so uh, we got some level fours that could use some leveling. Do they have a healer? No, they don't have a healer, so I have to level and Scott. So no, we're gonna start. Mind. We can't get Anoroth in there. Aranoth, sorry. Aran North. Because this particular class does not work with religious classes. They just, they hate each other. Um, Mandrak. That would be a nice thing to do. And then we could put some... Some power in the first slot. Followed by hot hot. <coughs> Excuse me. Maybe hot. Maybe hot hot. I'm not sure. Open vein, duelist advance, point blank shot. Yeah, we could we could give that a shot. And then in, in first we could do Willoughby three. Um. Yeah, we can do this. All right, now, so I'm going to use these people and I try to upgrade them a little bit if they haven't already been upgraded. Now, if you're watching this for the first time, I'll try to explain little bits and pieces as we go along, but I've done that a lot since I started streaming this game. And I can just say there's a lot of stuff that I can explain that won't make sense until you play it. It's just one of those games that requires It kind of requires you give it a shot. 
but um, it shouldn't be too difficult to understand if you just kind of pick up little things as you go along while watching the stream. I feel like the stream, you'll kind of start to understand bits and pieces. All right, so this is basically me trying to upgrade the characters, but... Okay, they're more or less upgraded. Um, I have... Some items here. That I might give Bounty Hunter... Melee skills, that's nice. Extra accuracy, good. So, what I'm doing is I'm just kind of making these characters. I have some items from my travels that I'm putting on the characters to make them more good. 10% damage, I'll take it over. This is downside though, you get minus 20% stun resist. Um, trap, disarm, dodge. I will give that a shot. I lose some stuff, but might be worth it. And then with um, Mandrak here, we have good items, occultist, debuff skill chance, move skill chance, plead skill chance. Plus eight dodge, that's good. We'll take the dodge. And then the bleed. The speed on Mandrak is going to be shitty, but let's give it a shot. Um, so our mission is we're going to do a media mission for this uh, resist. And it arms. It's pretty. Oh, I gotta kill a siren for that? I don't, I don't think I have enough confidence in my team to take down the siren. I know I don't. Oh, hey, Hootie. Hey, OT. Welcome back. I hope the release of Darkest Dungeon is going well for you guys. Um. Activate three animalistic shrines. Jesus, what's this thing? Oh, it's a long one. I don't want to do long. Let's just do this right here. Right here. Explore 90% of the rooms. This is a short one. This will get me back on the, on the saddle again. Did I get... Did you get your DM on Twitch? Uh, I don't check DMs on Twitch very often, so I'm not sure. And let me check. Uh, no, I don't, I'm not. I'm not seeing anything. If you trust me at all, you want to check this one. Of course, I trust you, Hootie. You're Hootie. There's no other reason not to. It's just your Hootie. Let me check it. Okay, this is... From OT DQ. It says here we have some... Custom lines. Oh! We have... Steal yourselves. It's time for the Buru. <laughs> Holy shit, are you serious? Some quality content you got going on here, Vinny. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Are you implying it's not quality, Wayne June? Wow. That is amazing. Thank you so much, Kevin, for these lines. This is this is amazing, and th thank you, Wayne June. 
some quality content you got going on here, Vinny. Amazing. That's absolutely fantastic. <laughs> they did custom. Oh, you got one too, Hootie? That's great. This is this is great. This is the best thing ever. Thank you so much. And there's a key I'm going to give away too. The uh, OT gave me a key. So I'll be raffling that off at the end of my darkest dungeon run. So you'll want to be around for that. Jeez, that is that is the coolest thing ever, man. Thank you so much. OT is a developer, yes, he works on the sound for the game, and that is actually the announcer, Wayne June. <laughs> oh, man. I knew all these paths once. Now they are as twisted as my own ambitions. It says, he says they're sending out 400 plus per personalized lines for Twitch broadcasters. That's pretty damn impressive. Nature herself. A victim to the spreading corruption. Malformed with misintent. That Wayne fellow has been busy, huh? <laughs> I remember when I first saw the game at, uh, I just sound like William Shatner for a second. I had a weird dream last night that I'll tell you guys about, involving William Shatner, oddly enough. Um, whoops. But before I do that, I remember seeing this game for the first time at, at PAX, PAX East. It was two years ago, and KY was like, have you seen this game? I'm really excited for it. I was like, this is, looks cool. And I was tired. I thought we had all of our interviews, but then um, KY was like, "No, no, no! Trust me. Let's let's interview these guys." Red Hook, and I said, "Okay." So we KY interviewed them, um, one of the develop developers, and it went really well. And I was just like, "Well, game looks cool. Is it going to be cool? I don't know." And then I explained. I, I watched the guy explain the game, and I was like, "Oh, oh, oh." And then it came out, and I've got about 35 hours in it. All right, here we go. What have we got here? What have we got here? We've got, uh, come hither. Nah, I'm going to go for a finish him. Wonder if this will. Nice. That'll that'll do the trick. I'm gonna go for the artillery. Nice critical hit. Holy shit! Sorry, Mandrak. God damn. When did you become so strong? Hmm. I'm gonna give this duelist advance a shot. See what I can do with this. Weakening curse. Let us reconstruct Willoughby too. Three. I lost track of Willoughby's. Don't grope me. Do not grope. Do not grope. Okay. So here's the thing. If you've never seen this game before, where your characters are is depend- it really, really important. You're, the moves that your characters have is dependent on what position they're in. So if you see the, the yellow dots and the red dots, the yellow dots represents the position your character has to be in to use it, uh, use the move, and the red dots illustrates what um, uh, what enemies it attacks. So that's that's really really important stuff. 
Masterfully executed. Masterfully! Lethargon for Thagan. Oh, the point blank shot. Yeah, I could use that on a corpse. But I'm, I'm not gonna do that right now. So I can move forward and back with uh, Hot Hot. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Okay. So you see, this, this is your torch right here. And when your torch is low, monsters become more powerful. In Radiance, may we find victory. And the rewards are better, but you also have more of a chance to be surprised. And other bad things happen when the torches are very low. OTDQ, that is very nice of you to say that you love the crew, but I want you to know your game has brought me many hours of enjoyment and you've always been here to answer questions and interact with my, my chat. And I just want you to know that, uh, you don't have to do any of that. That's really, really cool of you. And you guys are awesome. Red Hook is a really great developer, and I wish you guys the best of luck in the future. Now enjoy your ban, developer. <laughs> Could you imagine that? Oh my god, what a scumbag move that would be. You've also, um, given me lots of salt. I don't think I've ever screamed quite as loud as some of the times I've played this game. The chat can attest to this. In fact, if anyone wants to make a Darkest Dungeon anguish compilation, you know, I think that could be, I think that could be a lot of fun. Someone out there would watch that. Yeah, tentacles, seven, perfect. Good tentacles, good tentacles, ten out of tentacles. that up. I can't read this this character's name without thinking of Randy Marsh taking a shit. Hot, 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 hot. No, Hootie, please, no. No, 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 Hootie, I'm kidding. <laughs> Hootie. He knows I'm kidding. OT, we love you. I don't, you're not banned. We don't take kindly to developers around these parts. Let me tell you, let me, let me tell you something, man. Last time we had a developer up in here, try to tell us about a game. <laughs> that motherfucker got, got uh, banned from the chat and muted. T take kind of, take kind of that. Oh. I forgot to use my torch. Yeah, crit! And power. I, I- sorry, I'm excited for some reason. I know I am excited, but I'm just extra excited, so everything is Sonic. I- I apologize. Really, I do. Oh, I forgot that you could use a torch in battle. What do you know? Oh, will it be three? You need more power than that, my friend. Yeah, G GPM, how are you feeling? I've been- I've been worried about you, bub Bubby. I heard you were, um, uh, you attended a convention with some form of AIDS. <laughs> are you okay? Oh god, that's- that's stress that I'm not comfortable with. Any new viewers, your characters have a health bar as well as a stress meter. When you hit a hundred, your character will break or will become more vigilant. Mostly they break. 
cursed champion falls. And a lot of bad things can happen. And runs can be ruined. Characters, by the way, if your character dies, they're dead forever. So. Mateu. Yeah, that's not a great heal. Vinny, earlier we talked about you and Helix Snake's chat had good things to say about you. Well, Helix Snake is... is a great guy. And Helix has always been very supportive of everything I've done. And he's helped me with Skate 3 glitches. Um, he helped me understand Skate 3 glitches. And he's always been These nightmarish a pretty can be encouraging can be and positive dude. So, always... Uh, Always give credit to Helix Snake because he's the man. Oh, okay, I'm Zoophobia. That's cool. And that's not As the name of I a shitty U2 purchase, album. Spirits are lifted. Hello, hello. Clear. Okay, good. We surprised them. This is gonna be a good. This is gonna be a good. So, I have a choice of what to do. I'm gonna go for the dog. Well, yeah, dog! The dog is dead. Alright, that's one less thing to worry about. Jeans and the boots with the fur. <laughs> Should put an end to those two small mushrooms. I'm gonna try to. Nice. Whoa! What the fuck? I've never seen a crit heal like that. Whoa! These healers! Holy shit! That's the best heal I've ever seen. Not that I needed it. Precipitates a dizzying fall. I did. I really didn't need it. That was the most unnecessary but badass heal I've ever seen in my entire life in this game. Scott has leveled to three. Perfect. All part of the plan. Oh, man. Gotta get rid of that shit. Minus 5% HP. I see something long absent in the sunken faces of passersby. A glimmer of hope. Some quality content you got going on here, Vinny. Just, hmm? How did the game know my name? I think there's some people that just joined that don't know what happened with the, uh, the developers. The key is to fake it. The key is to just fake it, really.
Okay. Um. Let's see. What do we have here? Um. I'm gonna do a, a more advanced mission. Eye patch. Bowie eye patch. The Swine King. I, I still do not feel confident enough to take on the Swine King. Even with Follett and Aquamarie. And... Yeah, I mean, I just now leveled a healer who's got minus 5% max HP. Which is totally unacceptable. Just don't attack the little pig. We'll get there when we get there. It'll happen again. Kill the brigand 12 pounder. That's killed a number of my heroes. Kill the fulminating prophet. Wow. A lot of this is just designed to just kill me, really. Use Arbalest to clear marks. Oh, okay. That's actually kind of helpful. I don't have a leveled Arbalest, though. So, probably not going to do that just yet. Hmm. Let me tell you something. Let me do some upgrades. Alright, first upgrade I want to do is, well, you know what, let's get rid of that minus HP thing, because that, that needs to go. Meaning, you know what, I can't do that, because then I won't have a fucking healer. How much HP does she have? She's got 36 HP, alright, fine, she gets to stay. Um, alright, we're gonna go for the fucking Swine King. Okay, so that's upgraded. I'm gonna bring Follett. Aquamarie, who has the Iron Swan leveled up. What moves is she using? Wicked Hack, Yop. Breakthrough and Adrenaline Rush. Hack. That's me, a wicked hack. I'm a wicked hack fraud. Okay. Bullet, I think, is gonna be more or less. Fine. What's full it have? I don't want to waste too much moment. Withstand, solemnity, chop, intimidate. Okay, good. Alright, so who else are we bringing on this wonderful magical journey? Crossbone? Crossbone could be an interesting choice. Get someone who can get prot or weaken the Swine King. A cultist, perhaps. I, I don't have the, um... Yeah, I don't, I don't have anything. I, I only have one occultist. My previous one died. A horrible and sad... Well, Scrotes is now... I may as well not even have this character. Or these three characters, because I'm just going to die instantly if I use them. I need to get really good at this game. Swine King is weak against status effects. Anything that can make him bleed over and over again. Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Is he in the front or the back? Bounty Hunter Mark now reduces protection. 
as does the Hound Masters. Well, I, I don't have any of the appropriate classes for for the swine. Could use a Vestal up front. That's a thing. Damage. Minus 20% damage. Minus 7% accuracy. Swine King is in the front. What about my Jester? Kill Jester. The Jester has some debuffs, I think. No, the Jester doesn't have debuffs. The, the Jester has buffs. I don't want to be rused into death because this boss will fucking kick my ass. Oh, man. And Garonicus does not have the appropriate stress to handle this. An AoE debuff? Oh, um... Range forward three. Harvest. Oh yeah, that's... well, harvest is something. Does that cause bleeding? Yeah, that causes bleeding. Bring a man at arms. I, I I could bring Theon. You know what? I'm gonna give it a shot. Let's see what position. Finale. I can't do the finale. Dirk stab does forward one slice off. Battle Ballad. Is this a debuff? It's a bleed. And it does... 100% bleeding. It's three bleeding for three... I'm sorry guys, this is a little bit boring, I know. As long as I have a good healer, you think the man-at-arms can tank? Alright. He's a little stressed, but I'm gonna try to get the Jester to stress heal him. Uh, yeah, I, I agree. I think this can work. I think this can work. content you've got there, Vinny. Fourth class can be a toss-up. Okay, so we'll we'll make the fourth class a tosser. So who who is the, the tosser then? Okay. Well no more upgrades. We're going in. We're going in dry. Here's how we're doing it. Um, I'm gonna use Follett in the front. Who's got some healing and protection. I'm gonna use... Theon in slot number three. So, he's got Harvest. He's got the Solo. He's got, uh, Stress Heal. So, he can- he can be good. Um, Battle Ballad would be nice to have instead of Finale. I'm gonna make him just the buff class and stress heal. Actually, yeah, that'll work. And then healer in the back, and then Volbius to tank. Now, before I do anything, I wanna make sure this Jester has upgraded stuff. Yeah, it's, it's fine. It's good enough. Alright, we're gonna go against the Swine King. Yet again, here we go.
have to sell trinkets. Should be <laughs> remember to kill the small pig first. Yep, I will do exactly that. Don't worry. Oh boy! My first attempts at Here we go. Were crude. And the results disappointing. I soon found, however, that the type and condition of the host's meat was a critical factor. The best results came from pigs, whose flesh is most like that of man. Okay. A nameless abomination. A testament to my failures. It must so, be if I'm lucky, I'll be able to find the Swine King without too many battles. Or the swine, whatever, prince, king, whatever the fuck he is. Whatever his, his title is, I do not respect his title. He is a, is a swine! Okay, good start. A surprise attack. Buff. Should have started stress healing, but I will. I will soon enough. Here comes the vomit. Oh, nice dodge, dude. Nice fucking dodge. Ah, oh, the drums! Phobius needs to be de-stressed right now. Jester, give him a BJ. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Again. Oh, you get to go again, you scum? <laughs> Sorry, this game makes me very emotional. Very emotional indeed. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Scum! Treacherous Swain. I don't have an attack that isn't retribution. Uh, this makes me go forward. I don't really want that. I guess it'll work for now. We see my moving rampart. I'm just going to change one of these skills out. Because now I'm just killing corpses. Alright, cool. That was a good stress heal. 
Um, for party heal. Chop some swine. Destroy them all. Okay, so crush. I'd rather have crush instead of rampart. I don't want to fuck too much with my party's position. Well, actually, you know what? They're kind of both interchangeable. Like, Follett can use all of these moves front and back. I'll... Tr I'll do Crush for now, but I might change that eventually. Uh, what do we got here? The Sacrificial Stone. Nope. Nice, another surprise attack. Perfect. A chance to heal up a little bit. Play us the tune of your people. Good dodges. A powerful blow. It's a really good debuff when you hit them twice with it. Jesus. Look at this motherfucker, dodging attacks like a fucking butterfly. Follet Bo -bal Balboa. <laughs> Bo -bo -bla. Bo -bo -bo. Uh... Do want to give him the old debuff? Uh, retribute? Let's just kill him. Son of a bitch. Slap. Chop. Success so clearly in view. Or is it merely a trick of the light? It's one of my favorite lines. Overconfidence is my favorite line in this game. Slow and insidious killer. That one, you can't beat that one. But that one's pretty good, too. I like the way he says, Trick of light? Like, he's angry. Quizzically angry. Okay, good news. I get to do this fight Rats in a maze. with most of my health. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna focus on buffs. Um, accuracy and crit, that's nice. That's pretty nice. Um, what else? Weapons practice, plus damage, plus crit. This is plus protection and damage. Yeah, I'm gonna do that one. It's really good. I'm also gonna get rid of her stress. One companion plus accuracy plus dodge. Um. Yeah, I want that ac. I want that dodge. 
on uh, someone. Let's give it to uh, Follett. Um, I could also really buff the fuck out of Follett and make him like my main damage dealer. Let's do it. is struck. A blazing star is All right. born. A hey, question for anyone who knows these things better than I do. Who was killed last time I did swine person? Who are we avenging? The light. The promise of safety. I lost my vestal. As the light gains purchase, spirits are lifted. It was Ponka. Purpose is made clear. This one's for Ponka. You swine. You swine. Bastard. Make it bleed. Nice, good protection. That is good protection. We can even get more good protection. Go for another harvest. Get that bleeding early. And with the clutch, um, guard failed. I think he's, he's still got the protection buff. I'm not sure. Um, gonna go for one more, one more bleed. Oh, look at that! Nine damage per round for three rounds. That is beautiful. Time to start healing. No, I do not touch the little one. The little one sets the big one off and then I die. I have to go for the big one. Damage. Still alive, taking damage. And these two, huh? Yeah. Um, inspiring tune, battle ballad, speed, accuracy, crit. Let's buff those motherfuckers. Debuff this motherfucker again. Really lose some of that damage. There we go. That is good stuff. This battle is going fairly, fairly good. Fairly well. Fairly well. That's how you say that. Don't be like me, kids. Be smart. I'm gonna stack one, of, one more of these fuckers on here. Again, oh nice, minus 87% damage, minus accuracy, Fold it, my dude, carrying the team on his back, my dude.
Okay, all right, it's got some damage in. Got some damage in, Mr. Swine. Swine cunt. I'm sorry, Swine King, Kit King, your, your grace. Bleeding. I'm gonna go for um, the battle ballad. Buff my fellows. I don't even want to uh, touch the little one because even if I do like a debuff on the little one, big one flips out and makes life very difficult. So, this is the best course of action. Good. Power. Good crit. Good bleed. Oh. Oh, that's, that's, that's a little different. Just gotta keep debuffing. Come on, Volbius. Save, save Anne's got. Alright, Anne's got lived. Kinda like just barely, but it's fine. In the harvest, has the harvest lived a little fecker named the Swine King. Still a little more harvesting. As long as I keep these Intimidate debuffs up, I think I should be a little bit better off. Um, I'm gonna go for a defense here. Just to cut some of that damage if he manages to hit. Alright, it worked. Got some of that damage down. Do not stun. God damn it. That's just what I ordered. That's just what the doctor ordered. Yeah. Get some of that damage on there. I'm gonna go for another harvest. So we're just stacking that bleed. Go for a chop this time it's for the extra damage. Come on. Almost. Oh, he's only got. Three HP left. And has got tanking this motherfucker. Grievous injury. Palpable fear. Oh man, it's the little fucker. It's Wilbur. That's the real scumbag. Wilbur is the scumbag here. How many rats will it take to gnaw through it? Oh Wilbur, you're so like fucked! You are so fucked, Wilbur. I can't wait to see this little fucker die. Ponka will be avenged. Avenged, I say! Just may as well heal some stress so they don't have to wait around in town. little scumbag. This little scumbag. These nightmarish creatures can be felled. They can be beaten.
feels good, man. Feels real good, man. Thank you guys for the suggestions and for the, um, for, for believing in me. Explore a little bit. Yeah, I could have done some exploring. That would have been, that would have been all right. But, oh well, too late. All the decadent horrors I have seen pale in comparison to that final crowning thing. I could not look, nor could I look away. Master Jester, level four. Oh, that four was bad. It was okay up until then, kind of. Thank you um, for the subs tonight, whoever subbed. I see, I saw a few. I just want to thank you. Again, I'm not unappreciative. There's a fine line between being unappreciative and being too appreciative so that one might encourage others to sub by telling the whole world how great it is to sub so which that's why I don't really talk about it too much but but it is appreciated thank you <clears throat> okay is this what I got the tooth ring protection HP, stress damage, uh, res stress resistance, and then minus 15% damage. So basically the thing about this is it is a very good item for tanks, but you lose, you lose your damage with it. That, that would have been nice on Volbius in the previous quests. Really good quest, by the way. Shocked at how well that turned out. Let's do one more. Well, following is appreciated too. Just the fact that you guys are here is appreciated. Don't don't think any of it goes unappreciated. Just the fact that you're watching makes you my bubby. You know what bubby is, right? Mm-hmm. Get the gimp! Yep! Get the gimp! Some quality content you got going on here, Vinny. So anyway, let's do another mission. Uh, I'm gonna do a short mission. Room battles. I'm gonna do lower levels again, because I need to level some of these feckers. And... I want to try to get this f guy in here. He, he doesn't work with everyone. So the Abomination is a class that transforms. It's an amazing class. Um. I'm just going to do it like a whole weird combination of things. You know, I'm just going to try a bunch of different, like, people are going to just do a weird party combination. I've got, um... Yeah, we, Danger Bone is going to be in the back doing some cool stuff. We got our healer, who's also quite the debuffer and attacker. We've got, um... Fapon with just a variety of insanity. And then this character... Well... We'll find out. We're going... We're going... We're riding on the highway to the danger bone. That's what's happening.
What do we got here? Noxious Blast. Two Plague Grenade. Uh, we could do like an incision. If we don't want to buff, but I think this these two are pretty good. I don't think I want to change that stuff right now. That stuff is pretty good. Maybe we could go to the blacksmith. I, I also need to um, get rid of that 5% minus HP thing on the Vestal because that shit can just really just eat, eat every dick known to man. Play grenade, noxious, smoke bomb, and battlefield. You like the smoke bomb? Let's take a look. Smoke bomb. Oh, you mean disorienting blasts? What does this do? It stuns. Um. Oh, it clears the corpses. Let's give it a shot. Get rid of the buff. We'll put the disorienting blast on it. it it's got a stun and it shuffles. I don't think that's too bad at all, actually. Um, maybe I'll fuck with trinkets just a little bit right now. So you, you see how my mouse is doing that? Do, do you guys ever like just kind of like, it's that weird thing with your leg, where you just kind of like make your leg go up and down? What is that? Why do we do that? Why do guys do that specifically? Like, do don't we do that a lot more? Abominations in the front row must transform to attack. Put him one space back, okay. Stimming? I don't know, it's weird. It doesn't- that doesn't happen often. But, uh, yeah, I do it. And- and it's actually- It's happening and it's moving my chair, which my arm is resting on, which is moving my mouse. <laughs> what the fuck? Um... This character loses a move. I'm obviously I'm dying, Hootie. Um, yeah, I, I'm. Uh, I lose a move in the front with the Houndmaster. You see, the Houndmaster here does not have access to that ability, which is one of the best Houndmaster abilities. I could do the Blackjack, so we'll just do the Blackjack just to make the Houndmaster. The this is again a very odd combination for me. And I'm eager to try it, but it's definitely gonna take a little finagling and getting used to Get that black Jake. Black Jake. Black Jake. Black Jake. Something's wrong with me tonight. I, seriously, I have. Too much energy for this time of night. We can slay them even faster. It's already shovels been used. It's amazing how these shovels are just so incredibly, predictably necessary. Just vomit on them. That's nice. That's good. It's a good de debuff and a vom. Right. Like I 
going to go for the swine. Um, that should kill the swine next, the beginning of next round. I just don't want the stress. That's why I'm going for the drummer, because they can induce stress muchly. And I definitely don't want that happening. gonna stress my heroes out until I need to. Great there we go. Oh, beautiful. Oh, that worked really well. They didn't even get a chance to attack with that, with that setup. That was nice. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Oh, still one HP, huh? Don't worry, I got just the move. Monocles. Surges as the enemy crumbles. That's Knuckles' mom. Ma Knuckles. Oh, there's a madman in the back. Uh-oh. Um... Let's do the transform. Fuck it, we're gonna do this. Let's do that move. Okay. Play grenade. Get those dots on there. Oh, lots, lots of nice dots. Very good. Tentacles. You can't go wrong with orange tentacles. Speaking of orange thing, I don't know why this reminded me, but did you guys? See the fucking lightsabers that you can spar with? Have I brought this up? The, the things on Saber Forge? In um, Force Awakens, they actually use real. Well, not real, but you know, they use like. Um, they used lightsabers that had like a light source to them. So that's why you can see the light on the characters. It's basically just a lot like the lightsabers, like the effects lightsabers that you used to see, except they're really bright and they're built for sparring. Yeah, it's it's really cool. So I went on Saber Forge and it's so tempting because they have these like custom made awesome looking lightsabers that you can unscrew the like the thing and they show a video of a guy beating the shit out of a tree with it at full force and the blade does not break or bend. It's crazy. Uh, yeah, they're really expensive. They're really expensive. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Rrrg! Alright, need to transform you back into human. Perfect. Oh yeah, no, of course. I definitely want one. Why wouldn't I? They look cool. There, there's a bunch of websites that do it, not just Saber Forge or anything specific. There's a lot of websites. And again, I wouldn't even spar with it. That's the crazy thing. I hate when you see something bright and shiny, and it's like, that looks so cool. And then, 
you just, you're just like, no. Just don't do it. Right? Right? You see a fucking lightsaber? What, what the fuck is a lightsaber anyway, right? If there's like the handle, you can, I think, you can get the handle for like 150 and then you add like another 200 to get the blade and the sound. And you can like upgrade the 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 brightness of it. And it is what they used on the set of Force Awakens, which blows my mind. Slowly, gently, this is how a life is taken. I'll show you one uh, in, a, in a little bit. I'll show you something cool, and then I'm gonna end up advertising for this place. Never mind, I'm not gonna show you one. But there was a little video released of, um, the forest scene. And you see, you know, the, the two characters that are fighting. I don't want to spoil anything, because the movie has some good stuff going on in it with, like, you know, it's it's a good movie to see for the first time blind, just without expecting anything, which I think is probably going to be impossible by now, since it's been out a month. But, um, the forest scene, you, you see them fighting with the lightsabers, you know, without the special effects put in, and it still looks like they're using lightsabers. Really? I just got the runs? I got fucking diarrhea from that? Hang on a second, I have to do something to celebrate the occasion. Um... Look at that, the runs. Look how terrible this is! This is the worst thing ever! God damn it. Running down the gutter with the piece of bread and butter. Diarrhea. Diarrhea. Running down the gutter with the piece of bread and butter. Diarrhea. Diarrhea. Some people think it's funny, but it's really wet and runny. Diarrhea. Diarrhea. Sorry, we're late, Papa. Diarrhea. <laughs> Ancient traps lie in wait. Unsprung and thirsting for blood. Some quality content you got going on here, Vinny. It's like the sound of a disapproving elder. I don't know how old Wayne June is. Probably not even that old, but... That's the just the sound of someone who's just... He knows what's happening here. He knows what's happening on this website, and he knows the content is, is not quality. So whenever I play that, it reminds me. Overconfidence. It's slow, insidious, etc. etc. Pretty good attack. The the manacles. That's actually a really decent attack for his human form, which seems to be less useful or less powerful overall. But um you get good damage with a stun. That's that's some pretty pretty decent shit right there. Ma knuckles would be proud. Same thing with paw knuckles. Um, just gotta get rid of that fucker. So he had no health. I don't want to risk him taking a munch out of one of my characters like this. Will I stream Far Cry Primal? I don't know. Um, I was a little interested in Far Cry Primal. I thought about it. 
I'm kind of far cry fatigued. But a victory nonetheless. At the moment, I have a little bit of, um... Yeah, I just, I'm not feeling the Far Cry right now. Far Cry 4 was, was cool and all, but the series... I, I need to really get away from it. Primal looks different. So I might be My interested, because it seems... Are the exception, and not the rule. It seems different enough to warrant a purchase. Oh my god, Fat Pond's just getting f fucking fapped off. I don't even know what that means. But he is not having a good time right now, Fat Pond. Bleeding. Stressed. I'm hoping that that room has nothing in it. Mechanical hazards possessed by evil intent. Great. That's why I don't have lick wounds, because I am... I have no way to use it if I'm in the front. Fapon cannot... cannot use... Fallout 4 is very close to being finished. I think we have one... one stream of Fallout 4 left, I believe. It should be a long one. I'm gonna try to do Paladin Dance's quests, actually, if, if I can. And then end the game. That's my plan Radiance, for Fallout 4. We find victory. I feel like Dance needs a little bit of attention, because he was... He was fun. We had a lot of fun with him. But yeah, one stream of that, and then begins a whole new round of games. Uh, Final Fantasy Explorers is coming out soon. Which won't be a, a full stream, but I'll definitely- I'll, I'll be playing that one offline, but I'll also be streaming it from time to time. So, there's that. And then I'll also be, um... There was something else. I can't think of it. Oh well. Uh, Super Metroid, you know, I, I told you there's gonna be a lot of cool stuff coming up soon. Monster Hunter, I, you know, I played a little Monster Hunter today and I'm just not feeling it. Um, I took down a... Kongalala and Gisaropops, whatever it's called. And, um, I had to relearn how to play the game. And I was just fucking up miserably and wasting a lot of my equipment. And I still enjoyed it, but I just... I don't know. It's just not happening right now. Monster Hunter, I tried. I'm just not feeling it. Oh, Fire Emblem, I might stream, considering it. Considering I did, um, previous Fire Emblem. Fire Emblem Fates could be a really good idea. Dark Cloud 2 I streamed years ago, and while there are no recordings of it, um, take my word for it. I loved it. Really great game. But it's really long. It's a very long game. Do not stress, Danger Bone. Danger Bone, please! A 
decisive pummeling. Yeah, that was actually really good. Um, I don't have stress heal. Fuck it, get rid of them. Get rid of them. Do we need them? Get rid of them. I guess I could do another, um... Yeah, oh yeah! Twilight Princess HD, yeah, that'll- that'll be a day one stream. Just trying to- trying to do a thing here, if possible. Oh, God damn it! No! No! injury. How Fuck! Yes! That worked out! That definitely worked out. Awesome. Just want to get rid of some of the stress before we exit. Um, transform back into human. There you go. Oh, it was only one. Only whatever. It worked out. Success so clearly in view. Or is it merely a trick of the light? I forgot to open the Their treasure chest like a fade. dope. Their confidence is shaken. That was so stupid of me. Obsession caused this great foulness, and it is shameful that I must rely upon you to set it right. Well, that was, um, that worked out well. Today was a good stream of Darkest Dungeon. I just wish I opened the goddamn treasure chest. Let me get rid of the diarrhea. Okay. And that'll be your Darkest Dungeon for the night. It's still great. I feel like they might have even fixed a few of the grievances from that big patch that pissed a few people off. I'm not sure. But, um, it's good. And it's out. It's no longer in early access. This is the, the full release of the game. And it's still one of my favorite games on Steam. So, I will stream more Darkest Dungeon when the mood strikes. But, 